This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Discoveries, their physical computing unit, and I'm on the lesson arrays and color LEDs. Random selection. You can also select a random element in the list by using the random number block instead of an index. Right, we would use random number for the index instead of saying it specifically is what they're saying. The program selects a random icon from a list of from a list and displays it on the screen. When the left button is pressed right now, the icons are always blue. Oh, okay, so it displays it on the screen when the left button is pressed, icons are blue. Add code that will make that will select a random color from the list and use that as the icon color. Got it. And so they created an array, right, a list. I'm going to just shrink that. A list of, we have enough space, um, of the icon names. And so if I hit run, I think they said left button, and then left button again. Yeah. So we want to be able to change the color if we hit right, is what they asked. So let's reset. Let's go to show box. And I need another onboard event for the right button. So on the event of the R button being pressed, we want to, and we're going to do something similar here, except set property image dot icon color. So we're going to grab another set property. We want to set the property of, yep, the ID of this is image. We want to set the icon color property of image to be, and look how they did it. Up here, icons, which is the name of their list, the name of their array, and then they set it to be equal to 0 to 4. They pick 0 to 4 because 0 is the first index, and 1, 2, 3, 4. And that way, whatever this number will be, it will randomly select one of their icons. So, we want to do something similar, but with colors, right? Yes, they called it colors. Colors, and then we're going to need brackets. And... Inside these brackets, we're going to want math, random, number. Oh, goodness. I'm going to switch to text. I need square brackets. There we go. And then for colors, we have 0, 1, 2, and 3 as options. Even though there's four colors, we want to use 0, 1, 2, and 3. So I want a number between 0 and 3. Let me switch back to blocks. I think it might be easier to read. Okay, let's see uh, how this does. Oh, that was strange. Okay. Okay, now let's try. Aha! I'm hitting the right button now. Random color, random color, random icon, random color, random color. Awesome. Let's keep going. 